and this year uh, it, it was an amazing one because we we all went and marched into the into into the city the 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 roads were, were blocked only for them and and the, uh, the officials were there and they, they they took their demands and they, and and they promised that they would make changes because for even from last year we were it, we were demanding things like the roads the the houses no, no piped water and things are changing we, we had had uh, advocacy workshops with them and uh, which made them open up they were they are now able to talk about their needs they are they are actually have able to make their own demands you know like don't leave us with the children and give the money to the to the the mothers because they take it away and we we we, we remain having to pay out of our pension and things or please don't abuse us and things like don't rape us and the children. We, they're sleeping with us and the children doesn't cure AIDS. You know now they've, they are op they're, they're brave enough, they can open up and talk, which we thought that was wonderful. And because Musa is there, and we, we keep on nudging the government, you know, and uh, demanding some things, they definitely, is a change. We can see that whatever we do, it does help. Like last year, when it was Age Demand Action, we we were among the things that we were advocating for. We were talking about the government must give the older people uh, money, you know, a foster grant, because they are caring for the people and nobody cares for them. And because of that, truly, it's happening. It's happening. Edna, Edna Mbesa, working for Musa in South Africa, and as I say, I'm very old, but very strong and still wanting to push forward to say age demands action.